Welcome back to the channel, it's Officer Brick here. I'm back with another city-related mock. And uh, in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at my TV news van. Um, I didn't really have one of these in my city. And I figured that I would just decide to put one together. It's sort of meant to be, uh, I guess it's sort of like a satellite truck. Kind of like a box truck. Not quite a small van, more of a cube van, I would say. And um, yeah, I just, uh, I put one together. I, uh, I didn't have the stickers, I order those separately sometimes. But overall, I think it looks pretty, uh, pretty good. This piece up here is, uh, it's actually from an older Lego set or a classic Lego set from the 90s. Uh, one of the more original uh, TV releases. It was part of a helicopter and uh, news van. And I figured I would just sort of put it on the roof there just, just to give it a bit of a different look. I mean, sometimes these, uh, these news vans and these news trucks, you know, they have different equipment on them um, just to sort of help with uh, obviously satellite uplink, but uh, you could also have... Uh, antennas and um, I don't know maybe uh, climate control in the uh, uh, climate control it, it doesn't necessarily serve a purpose but uh, in uh, in my uh, Lego world maybe it sort of does and uh, then just taking a look up here we've got the uh, we've got the satellite dish and uh, what, what I've noticed a lot is there's always that cable that coils around the uh, the satellite dish that uh, so uh, yeah I just figured I'd add I'd add that on there some extra detail and then uh, when they're not broadcasting the satellite just folds down and then they can just sort of take off as you can see here and uh, if we look on the side of the truck here there's uh, not much going on this uh, this is sort of meant to represent maybe a just a receptacle if they had to uh, plug something into the truck. And uh, there's also one on the other side as well. Then if we take a look here in the back, you can obviously see uh, got a, just got our door to get inside the uh, side of the vehicle and uh, got some more equipment in there. Then we'll, uh, we'll take a look at the inside of the truck here, I think. All right, so first we'll take a look inside the uh, driver's compartment here and sort of see uh, just got a bench seat in there and then uh, the inside of the truck just move that out the way just pop off the uh, pop off the uh, roof here and you can just sort of see right inside the uh, if I open the door should get a bit more light in there there we go and just sort of see you've got your uh, maybe your satellite uplink and uh, maybe a radar screen to track storms and then uh, on the other side there we've got a couple of computers so they can uh, I don't know maybe uh, transmit the information to the reporter and from the news station and then you just have uh, got an extra camera in there and also a coffee maker so and uh and yeah no that's about it for the interior pretty uh pretty standard stuff for uh tv news fan and you can just sort of see the uh the roof sort of has a bit of a overhang over the windshield it's uh it's a nice look i think and then finally we've got my uh my city news crew and then uh, the uh one on the left here obviously is the camera operator and sort of uh Sort of just made this uh, camera with a tripod. Uh, I mean, it works. I mean, it's good for uh, when you're out in the field and uh, you gotta hit the reporter. I mean, he could always carry it, but uh, why not give him a stand? And then you've got your reporter there in the center, 
and then the uh, figure on the left on the uh, right he sort of works inside the truck he's sort of the uh, technician so he'll be the one who's uh, working the feed communicating information to the uh, reporter and uh, just uh, making sure the uh, satellite uplink is uh, going through to the truck all right so that just about wraps it up for uh for this mock hope you enjoyed having a look and uh, i'll be back soon with more uh more content more city related content on the way feel free to leave me a comment um go ahead smash that uh, subscribe button really helps out the channel and i'll talk to you again real soon